Hello, it's time for the first edition of Radical Reviews. Cuphead Show Season 2, let's begin. Season 2 is off to a pretty great start. With Jailbroken. Okay. This was a really funny and fun episode. It was just enjoyable. I loved Mugman. I loved the rhymes. I loved the interactions. And I loved the Cyclops. Overall, Season 2 is off to a great start. Hopefully, we can keep this quality up with the next episode. Charmed and Dangerous. Two amazing episodes. Wow. In a row. I like the beginning. I like the go. I love the reference to Hildeberg. I love the gumball. I love to miss Chalice. But there should have been an, a Phantom Express reference. Going under jailbroken oh and we're traveling to the seas i did like the animation in the episode and some of the moments were boring though the songs aren't too good either carol maria is amazing and the references are amazing i loved cuphead and mugman going under drummed and dangerous another brother um yeah this is okay i guess the episode Cuphead is sweet and I like Mugman at points. And I liked Ruby and Croaks. But there's two main problems. The episode is predictable. And Ball Boy. Oh my days. Ball Boy is so annoying. He's the worst character of the show, I think. Going under High Seas Adventure. After episodes that decrease, it's good to see one that's an increase from the previous one. I did love the backgrounds. The jokes are good. I like the interactions between Cuphead and Mugman. Baroness is creepy. I like the design of the castle. It was um, amazing. I like the bat Baroness. And I loved Mugman. Going under Charmed and Dangerous. Now, the Ice Cream Man is one of the show's finest. It was a great Mugman centered episode. And it was quite scary. But it was great in that. The animation looked amazing. And it made me appreciate the animation more. Because I didn't like it at first. I loved Elder Kettle and Cuphead. The story was amazing. And the the Magman uh, part. Like the Captain Mugbeard bit. And it was just uh, great. An amazing episode. I'm definitely in my top three of the series. Going above, uh, what's it called? Jailbroken. Piano lesson is great. I love the introduction of Ludwig. Some, uh, and I really do love Ludwig. And it made me realise, I think Mugman is the best character of the entire show. Elder Kell was amazing and I did love Cuphead. But the episode was predictable and some bits can be boring. Going under Sweep Temptation. Release the Demons is amazing. I love the devil. He is the best character of the show. Definitely. The, he reminds me of Hades from Hercules. He's just an, an hilarious character. And the characters in this episode are fantastic. I love the horsemen. The tension is amazing. And Stickler was great. This was devil, the devil's best appearance so far. Oh, tied with swear luck next time. Going under. I scream, man. Dead broke is fine. I enjoyed the interactions. I like the setting and the ghosts. Because there's not much to say. Going under. High seas adventure. Rassel folks is great. I I really enjoyed the slapstick. And I love the introduction of Werner Woman. The reference to the game is amazing. And Werner is just so enjoyable. Elder Kell is also amazing. Where would I put it? Just under Charmed and Dangerous. Say Cheese is okay. I loved Elder Kell the episode. Just, it wasn't the best episode of the show. The plot wasn't that good. I much prefer predictable plot. Uh, over quite... Meh plots. 
Some jokes were good, but it's not the best. Going on, uh, going on the high seas adventure. Oh my days, Cuphead is annoying this episode. It was just the same joke, and it was, and it was funny to start with, but it just got repetitive and annoying. Cuphead is terrible this episode. Going under High Seas Adventure. After two eh, kind of good episodes, we have a really great episode. I love the devil. I lo- he it was I was intrigued. The montage is amazing. I love the references to the game. The tension is amazing. I love I just love the devil. I was shocked at the ending too. And it was just an amazing season uh what two finale and I think it's just under uh Ice Cream Man. Here's my ranking. Number thirteen, another brother. Number twelve, Dead Broke. Number eleven, Sage Cheese. Number ten, Lost in the Woods. Number nine, High Seas Adventure. Number eight, a Piano Lesson. Number seven, Sweet Temptation. Number six, Rats All Folks. Number five, Charmed and Dangerous. Number four, Jailbroken. Number three, Release the Demons. Number two, Devil's Pitchfork. And number one, Ice Cream Man. But that's not the end of the video yet. We've still got one thing to discuss. So, which season is better? Season one, in my opinion. Even though the animation was better than season two, there were problems with season two. There was a lot less of Miss Chalice and the devil and King Dice in season two. Season one was had those three characters more, except Miss Chalice who came in at the end. But they are very close. They're both 9.25 seasons. But when I've tallied up the scores, season one is better. But season two is amazing still. The episodes were just so great. I loved... When they were good, they were fantastic. So Ice Cream Man and Devil's Pitchfork are in my top three of the show. And I loved um, a lot of the episodes. I loved Jailbroken. The only one that I wasn't a big fan of was Another Brother. But I still prefer that over... What's it called? Baby Bottle. So... That's all I really need to say for this video. Hope you enjoyed it and hope you're looking forward to many editions of Radical Reviews.